This is the start of a journey. It's a time to collaborate. It's something that is really organic and responsive. Absolutely blown away. It's so much creativity. There is a powerful message for parents. It feels amazing. Yeah. And let's let's carry on, let's take it further. What's not to like? I'm Alison Bingham, I'm Director of Business and Enterprise at the Bulwell Academy. Um, I'm here because I was asked to bring a project together to inspire young people to be able to make uh, informed careers choices at a younger age. It's a partnership with Bulwell Academy, Nottingham Academy, Farnborough to Ginogli, ourselves, Nottingham City Homes, Lloyds Bank and British Gypsum. And between us we've managed to really create a programme which um, hopefully will allow these young people of year eight to um, consider future employment um, in a way that they perhaps haven't thought of before. I went to a conference in London in 2013 where Mark Hill from Nashville came over and told us some of the story and I was so intrigued that I wanted to go and see for myself. The project is based on some work that took place out in Nashville in America where through really strong business and education partnerships young people were able to access employment with much more of a sense of realism and being ready for the world of work. We went with high expectations and they were far exceeded. We were just blown away by how fantastic the system is in Nashville. Alison at Borwell Academy was extolling the virtues of the Nottingham to Nashville uh, event and really wanted to kind of see elements of what they've done in Nashville happen, happen here in Nottingham. And I'm delighted to say that we, we got four schools together, all of whom were very like-minded, very keen to promote um, an understanding of what the real world is like for young people before they even make their GCSE choices. Four of us got together who were, were equally as passionate about employability and decided to put together a pilot project based on the Nashville to Nottingham model. So working alongside other schools with a similar mentality to us enables us to pool our resources and to help students to see that their school environment is a very small little pond if you like and they're about to enter a big ocean of employment opportunities. One of the key points to this project was to actually upskill the teaching staff and we created an externship or extern opportunity for our teachers. So each tutor has actually spent a day in the business learning about the world of work, learning about um, what happens in these jobs, so we, we gave them that experience to bring back into the classroom. I've been really interested by the project as it's developed in recent weeks. I've seen very young children starting to open their eyes. The traditional idea is that if you're going to work for a building company, the only jobs will be for bricklayers or plumbers or electricians. And what the children have begun to realise, each of them at different points individually, is they've begun to realise that actually there's a whole host of other jobs such as accountancy, management, marketing, product development, and it's really opened their eyes to the range of jobs that are available. The, the pupils have really, really got into this and um, they, they love it. They've really, they've really given their all on the project. So a month ago we did an um, introduction assembly where we introduced the whole year group to all the different um, companies. I then did a presentation to them about what I found out when I went to the company for the day. But I then took a, a back seat and let them kind of roll with it so they've done their own research, they've decided what they want to present, they've written their own scripts and, and so on, they've just kind of led it themselves. From my observation, they work very in terms of teamwork. They are working very well, they are learning to accept each other in the team and respecting each other's views. Some of those kids are very quiet, like Fatu, English as a second language, and yet she blows you away with that beautiful poem that she's written. We all know that healthy relations are the keys of peace nation. Jealous and conflicts we must avoid, so that beauty of life may be enjoyed. We just need to open our hearts, that's where peace clearly starts. Basically, it's about peace in Capital One and harmony. Like, when you read this poem, you will think that, wow, Capital One is a great workplace to work in because there's peace, harmony and respect to all people. Uh, my part really is that um, 
I'm letting people know that Nottingham Homes support their workers and colleagues, that women can do these things and Nottingham Homes support them doing this. You normally people think, oh, we're doing a presentation, we're just going to talk about it. No, you can do lots of stuff with presentation. This was more about what they own um, strengths are so we had some that wanted to do acting and dancing and so on and they've all formed all different groups and are, are really working together now and more or less it's a precursor to what's coming if this goes well you go to capital and you meet the team these children are only 12 13 years of age but their eyes have been opened i know they're going to tell you their eyes have been opened so a little bit nervous I hope it's everything I think it can be. I'm hoping it works well. British Gypsum. British Gypsum, as the company, is a leading manufacturer in the UK. Our research and development is well resourced and we are currently developing the company has a keyword, drive. Each letter of the word stands for the it's not all about working though. Lloyds offer different opportunities to do outside of your day job, such as one day People think one day job is boring, but they're wrong. Now it's time for us to tell you about women in construction. Help us with the colour back into Lloyds. This poem is written by Fatima. Capital One is full of peace and harmony, and later it will bring a happy memory. Nottingham City holds the place you want to be. We made a leaflet for you so you can read more about the bank and what it actually stands for. Always remember to work as a team. This will mean the business runs like a dream. So if you work in capital, the smile on your face will be more amazing. There's jobs for every single type of person like no matter what your passion is. Do it for your family, do it for yourself, do it for your lifestyle, do it for your health, do it for your prospects, do it for your dream, do it for the people who are always going to be Nottingham City home. just loved every minute of your presentations. It's been fantastic. So thank you to all of you. See you soon. The energy of those young people today that we, we, we and so much variety in their presentations. But more to the point, they really have found out about the world of work absolutely blown away. It's so much creativity and you know what was really um, good to see was um, that they got the they got the message that actually work is not just about going to the office and doing a job and going home and earning some money. So come along and discover what five or six different types of presentation and different different you know a, a poem that had never even occurred to me that that would be a way to present about a business. Particularly with women in construction for Nottingham City Homes, massive initiative that we've got running and you know to see that picked up on and, and developed in, in a real creative sort of um, exciting visual way. It feels amazing. Yeah, it's great to have all the stress out of you now that um, you've performed and been performing and practicing for weeks. But we know that there are loads of other students um, across the year eight groups in, in the four schools involved that will have absorbed just as much information. Um, you know, what we saw today was really just a snapshot. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's really fantastic. We're, we're really proud. We're really excited about the projects moving forward into next year, which will hopefully involve even more schools and even more businesses. There's no reason why we wouldn't want to see this carrying on because it's a programme which has got good merit and, and good value to the young people. As a business, we will continue to be involved with this, but I'd love to spread the word to other businesses and other genres of business. And I hope that we have together with the businesses and the schools created a partnership that's going to be embedded in Nottingham for a long time to come.